Hi there, my name is Charlie from Henry Herbert Taylors um, and today we're joined um, by Nick Wilk from Holland and Sherry on Savile Road to talk about suit fabrics um, and what to wear and what not to wear uh, with your suit. And I think um, quite quickly uh, a customer can get lost amongst the labyrinth of suit fabrics available to them. Um, so this is just a quick um, talk with Nick to talk about the different varieties of cloth available. Um, and I think a good starting point is with uh, worsteds and woolens. If you could just tell us about the virtues of both, Nick. Really? Yeah. Well, we'll start first of all with a flannel, uh, which has a beautiful sort of covered finish. Uh, flannel is beautiful to wear, but it's not the sort of thing that is subjected to everyday wear. Mm. Uh, it's something that has to be uh, nurtured and cared for and worn fairly infrequently. Against another Prince of Wales, this is a beautiful clean cut worsted. Mm. This is perfect for the workaday suit, something that's going to be worn often. Um, and because it's clean cut, it will keep its shape. Um, and will meet the rigours of uh, everyday wear. Also, it shows less uh, signs of wear against uh, something that has a milled or a flannel finish. So two different finishes to both of these cloths, uh, obviously offering different qualities in both of them. Can you get each in different weights and different patterns? Yes, indeed. Uh, there are lighter weight flannels, there are lighter weight worsteds, of course. Okay. But you can see there is a contrast here. Mm. But as I say, both of them are excellent in their own right, but it depends on what the customer wants to meet the requirement. And a, a common question I have is um, what makes a good travelling suit? Is there a particular fabric you might recommend for putting a travel suit together? There is indeed. Um, again, we're looking at another Prince of Wales, but the high twist suiting. All wool is excellent for a travelling suit. So that's slightly lighter finish. Lighter weight, yes. This is, uh, again, lighter weight altogether. Excellent for summer wear. But because the yarn is woven tight, it's less susceptible to creasing. The sort of thing which you put in a suitcase, hang it up in a hotel, yeah. and the following morning it will be fine to wear. So something you can travel around the world with, get ready to go to your uh, meeting on the other side of the world, and it still looks good. Absolutely. Yeah. Good. And are there any um, natural fibre alternatives um, when putting a suit together? There are some excellent uh, natural fibres, of course. For summer, there's been a real renaissance with natural fibre. Linen, of course, is beautiful to wear. And of course, you can see with our range, we have a lovely range of, uh, of colours, sort of rose pink, pale blue. Lends itself beautifully for trousers or suits yeah. or jackets. Um, and also cotton. Uh, we sell a great deal of cotton yeah. too, but again, you can see that there are some beautiful colours mm. um, and again, excellent for trousers, yeah. jackets or for suits. I suppose um, uh, with both of these natural fibres, because they're worn in slightly different environments, you can afford to have a slightly brighter colour or something slightly more Absolutely. unusual. This is so true, being summer, you have that licence to do it. And linen and cotton lends itself most certainly. Just one concern I think some customers may have is um, about the creasing yes. in both of them. Is that something they should really worry about? Well, if one ha does have cotton or linen, it does wrinkle. Mm. Uh, but that is part of the character exactly. of the garment. Yeah. But if that is accepted, um, as I said, the beauty of a natural fibre is it's so cool to wear. Yeah. Something I often tell my customers is if, if you look after the suit, it will look after you. So of course it's a characteristic, I guess, of the cloth, but providing you care for it, it's going to hold its shape very well. Oh, absolutely. It's like anything, you have to take care of it. And, um, but most certainly, uh, I would endorse uh, the natural fibre, so cool to wear. Okay. Well, thanks very much for uh, joining us, Nick. Just before we go, um, I had heard a rumour that you can sometimes personalise your fabrics. Can you tell me a little bit about that service? Well, what we can do is we have something here where you can have your name or saying woven in the stripe, real your specification. Wonderful. And I imagine uh, that's a, a quite special service you offer and not something uh, everyone asks. That is a very special service, but of course any suit would be unique. Well, wonderful. Well, that would be a truly bespoke suit. Well, Nick, thanks very much for joining us. And I'm uh, Charlie from Henry Herbert Taylors. Thanks very much.